My name is Sam Cook, and I'm the program coordinator of the radio broadcasting program. The radio program is a two-year program, diploma program, that we offer here at Mohawk College. And what we do is we get the students ready for real life experience in the world of media, and we specialize in radio. So we do a little bit of TV, a little bit of writing, and of course, we, we focus on radio broadcasting. Uh, that could be anything from being on air, to doing some writing, to producing. Uh, we teach all elements um, under the radio umbrella, plus other avenues as well. So maybe you want to be an A&R rep for uh, Sony Music or, or Universal. Well, we will give you a little, uh, kind of little lessons on how to achieve that using your radio diploma. So um, I think that we're a pretty full program and a lot of our students who are within this program uh, do find jobs uh, after they graduate, which we're really excited and proud about. Courses range. Uh, we have writing, news, uh, we, we have our students on air. We have two radio stations here at Mohawk College. We have IgniteRadio.ca, which is our academic radio station. And um, that allows students to go on the air uh, live uh, with an audience and be graded on a real life radio station. And then once they, they kind of get the hang of that, we move them over to our FM radio station, which we have within the college, which we're really lucky to have an FM station at 101.5 The Hop. So there's two platforms for them to learn on. Ignite is more of a top 40 radio station, The Hits, and The Hawk is more of rock alternative uh, songs that we play there. So the students are really lucky to be able to have both platforms to work from. All of our equipment is up to par, up to standard, uh, sometimes even better than some radio stations have. So they learn on the equipment we have and they learn real life scenarios and they have fun at it as well. So if you walk past any of our radio stations, you usually hear them laughing and having fun. And that's kind of what I try to promote because you can work and have a work side and hand in your assignments on time and be serious, but you also need to be able to laugh and, and let that stress out. So I think that's what this program offers. We use a lot of industry standard equipment, iMedia Touch, which all the chorus stations across Canada have iMedia Touch. We use Selector, which a lot of stations still use, which is a program to schedule music. We use Newsroom, which is a program that spits out all the latest news. So if you ever wonder how radio announcers get their latest information and how accurate it is, well, it comes off this program called Newsroom. And we offer students the chance to learn that. There's a bunch of other equipment too that we use, Pro Tools, Adobe Audition for editing. So we try and get their hands on everything. So when they leave this building, they're knowledgeable on all pieces of equipment. We actually have a few, uh, more than a few success stories. Uh, just recently, if I can name a few, uh, Scott Laybourne, who is currently in second year right now, he's still finishing the program, but he got hired full-time as a producer, a technical producer on 102.1 The Edge on their morning show. Huge deal, went right from Hamilton to Toronto, unheard of, and he was able to do that. Mark Sprout, a graduate, or Mark Bradley, we call him Sprout, He's a graduate from 2015. He's now on air at Y108. Again, unheard of. Students usually go from Mohawk College to some smaller station across Canada and make their way back here. But he worked hard, and now he's, he's on the air. A lot of our students now are working at Bell Media, which includes k -Lite, TSN 1150, and Funny 820. And these PDs are coming to us looking for our students who are getting really solid knowledge down at Chorus Hamilton, Y108, Fresh FM, Fresh Radio, and AM 900 CHML. A lot of our students work there as well, and KX 94.7. So all the majors in Hamilton are actually looking for our students and hiring them. So there's just so many success stories. I'm super proud of them all.